Alright, so Assalamualaikum and uh, good morning everyone. Okay, so today we will learn about uh, how to create a button in Animate. Okay, so first of all, <coughs> this is very uh, basic button. Eh? Just draw a circle and then write down any words that you want. For example, uh, chapter or maybe a topic one. change the color all right convert to symbol modify convert to symbol please make sure you choose button and you can always name it yeah topic one underscore btn and click ok alright so once you convert uh, this image and text okay this uh, shape and text into button you need to double click and you will see that they already provide uh, this button on timeline right so if you see on your screen right now there is a scene one and also topic one underscore button so there is two level and uh, in this topic one underscore button, uh, there is a one timeline, okay. And in this timeline, it provide you the up state, over state, down state, and hit state. So what are the differences between these four state? All right. Usually in ups is the default or what you are going to see uh, on your screen. This is the default uh, of the button, okay. And then uh, you need to insert keyframe. So keyframe is uh, sorry over state is used for um, once you uh, over your mouse or the cursor on the button something will happen all right for example we are going to change the color okay now let's play control enter to play okay this is the mouse over this is the up state over state Alright, so the, you can provide uh, or change uh, to any color yeah, on overstate. How about down and hit? Okay, so you need to double click on the button one more time. Okay, down is when you press. Okay, it's up to you whether you want to change the color or not. So we will try to change it, the color. <coughs> okay, and let's see one more time. This is up, over, hit. Okay, so there is three color changes eh, for this button. How about hit? Hit is actually the area that you are going to detect uh, the button. For example, for this one, if you choose hit, uh, if you insert keyframe, so the hit button, uh, the hit area for the button is only this over. So which means if you put cursor out from the button area it's not going to detect anything okay so which means the button is not functioning if you click uh, on the outer side all right it's only working if you click in inner side okay see here if i click there is nothing happen all right so we can always change the heat area all right you can uh, draw if you want to make a bigger uh, heat uh, area so you can draw a square okay let's check right now the button we can detect the button if from the outer side also eh? so it depends it depends on your heat area all right and um, this uh, square or whatsoever uh, function uh, or the heat area okay it's not going to show in the uh, in your screen yeah? only inside uh, this uh, timeline alright ok so that that is the basic thing lah, uh, the basic thing about uh, how to create the what we call it how to create a simple button alright so next I would like to do some animation 
Okay, uh, it's okay. Animation we will put aside. Okay, what else can we do with over? Eh? Alright, so in over button, you can always put anything, not only change the color. For example, we can put text. Please click me to enter to topic 1. one section okay control enter it will shows you the text that give you instruction yeah okay so that is one thing and then we also can include uh, the what we call it a uh, shape also bring this word to the front oh sorry because the color is the same sorry yeah <coughs> I thought it's on the back. Okay. Alright. So you can show uh, instruction like that. Okay. So that is the basic uh, button. Alright. Now I would like to create another button that have animation in it. For example, if you draw Google. One G or double G, Google. Okay, so it's so okay lah if the wrong spelling. I'm sorry about that. Okay, now we have uh this one uh text, and then we need to draw a triangle. Okay. Alright, highlight everything, convert to symbol, do uh, change it the type to button. Alright, so we have button over here. Okay, insert keyframe. And this one, this triangle, we want to do a simple animation on it. Alright, so you need to go to modify, convert to symbol. But now, you need to change to movie clip because we want to do animation. So, we cannot choose button. Button inside button is not working. Eh? Right, so, just click OK. Right? This is already converted to uh, movie clip. Double click and then insert keyframe. Okay? Move the second uh, keyframe. And make sure that the triangle you move it uh, to the right hand side, right hand side. Sorry, and create classic twin. Okay, we are going to test it. All right. Control Enter. Okay. So the movement is working. All right. If you can see, okay. Um, if I point my cursor at the uh, in the white space in uh, this letter G, is there is nothing happen because of what? Because the heat area is only on the text itself, not inside the white area. So what you can do is. To make sure that this heat area <coughs> is big enough for you, okay. Alright, so there is a should be no problem, lah. Okay. The next thing is that um. We want to apply faded triangle at the end, yeah. So which means we need to put 
some alpha effects 